Triple class refractory patients are now one of the main challenges we have. Uh, we have treatment in multiple myeloma has relied in the PI, IMIDS, and GC38 monoclonal antibodies for, for many, time, for many uh, years, but now we are facing these patients that are, have become refractory to the three classes of agents. And as more earlier and earlier uh, every, every year, I would say. So after one or two prior lines of therapy, these patients have become triple class refractory. So we need novel agents for, this, for these patients. We, now we have um, many agents approved, and we have uh, Merflufen, we have uh, Salinexor, we have Belantamam, Afodotin, we have now even diesel engagers, Teclistamab, or the CAR-T, Siltacel and Idesel. But I think these are all Patient, uh, drugs for this type of patients, but the problem is that we, uh, some of them or many of them are not yet available. For instance, if we speak about Spain, we don't, we don't have the majority of them, we only have Belantamab available. So this is a still a challenge, uh, to how to treat these patients. We, have, we will have in the near future many of these uh, novel agents approved and available. Or, but approved they are, but available in our countries, but it still is a challenge. I think we still have to think how to best approach them to use a novel second generation or third generation of the previously used agents, and of course. But soon the, the future is optimistic because we will have this uh, probably very soon available for them.